Hello, welcome to Credit Matters TV. I'm Jose Kobayashi from Standard & Poor's Utilities and Infrastructure Practice. We recently assigned a triple B minus rating with a stable outlook to the Oaxaca 2 and Oaxaca 4 wind farm projects. Today with me is Monica Ponce, who is the primary analyst on this transaction. Welcome, Monica. Hi, Jose. Thank you. Could you please describe to us the projects, please? Sure. Uh, Oaxaca 2 and Oaxaca 4 are 202 megawatt wind farm projects located in the state of Oaxaca. Oaxaca is located around an hour away by plane from Mexico City. These projects have a 20-year power purchase agreement with Comisión Federal de Electricidad, which is Mexico's national utility company. What can you, the, the project reach an investment grade rating? How is this possible? Well, the projects have a many strengths. First and foremost is their purchase power agreement with CFE, which manages to eliminate price risk uh, during the life of the project. Uh, so this provides a great strength to, to this. Uh, also, the technology has been proven. This is provided by Axiona. They have been using this wind turbine since 2004 with an average availability of 98%. So this is another positive factor that the rating considers. Uh, and also the wind availability, which in Oaxaca tends to be uh, very good. What about financial performance? What are our expectations? Um, we ran a base case scenario that contemplates a P90 with 96% availability uh, and O&M costs set at $26 per megawatt hour. Uh, which is in the highest range of normal operating costs for this kind of projects. And under the base case scenario of both projects, the average uh, debt service coverage ratio is 1.40, 1 and the minimum is 1.40. Uh, they also have sufficient liquidity with debt service reserves of uh, six months and O&M reserves also of six months that mitigate any uh, wind uh, variations or O&M increases in a certain point in time. Okay. Well, given that the wind regime is a key rating consideration, could you tell us a little bit more about wind availability in the state of Oaxaca? Sure. Uh, we have an independent engineer opinion, Alatec, uh, for this project. And in their opinion, the wind conditions in Oaxaca are very favorable. Also, we have a research from other uh, independent technical advisors that agree with this opinion about the excellent uh, wind regime in Oaxaca, one of the best uh, worldwide. And this is because of the geographic conditions of the Isthmus of the Huatepec in Oaxaca, uh, where, is where both projects are located. Okay. Um, I also understand that the maintenance and operating expense is also a key rating factor. Could you tell us a little bit more uh, in this case? Yes, definitely. There are key consideration. We have uh, seen in other rated wind projects that O&M costs tend to increase uh, more than initially projected, uh, which, as you know, can cause a problem in cash flow generation. Uh, but in the case of Oaxaca 2 and Oaxaca 4, we believe there is an, a conservative uh, budget. As I said, it's on the highest range of normal operating costs. And we also uh, believe that Acciona is an experienced operator, uh, so that also provides uh, comfort. They have been operating another uh, wind uh, farm in Oaxaca region for the past two years, so that also provides some experience to them. Great. Well, thank you, Monica, and please let me remind you that the research updates on Oaxaca 2 and Oaxaca 4 are available at our website www.standardandpours.com.